which has been a pretty, pretty wild ride. <laughs> <laughs> I'm uh, laughing, so, yeah. but that is for the for the people that don't know. Like that is a a massive feat, and that's why I said earlier, like feels like you guys are moving mountains because. I mean, I, I, I know just, you know, from, from knowing you on a personal level, like it did take a year to kind of maybe get that first one, like under your belt, but it's like, I feel like watching you guys pull the trigger on the first one, it just, I mean, you had already had, had and experienced all the headaches through the first one. So you knew what to expect on the second and it's like, you know, one, two, three, four, five, it's like, I mean, that's a, that's a mass quantity of doors to be under management. And like my hat's off to you guys, you were, it feels like to me, you're doing it with, with, um, you know, honesty and integrity. Uh, you're not just trying to snatch up things that are just class D and, you know, just ruin, ruin the, the current tenants lives. And just, just like you said, be worried about, uh, the cash flow, right. You're building it. Yeah. Or ruin our lives, man. Those, yeah. Their properties are, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, yeah, I appreciate that though. Like, yeah. and it, it is like a big, uh, it's a lot of work, right? So like, but the behind the scenes is the, like, like for Shane, for example, poor guy, man, he underwrites, I think we're averaging around 300 properties reviewed for every property we buy. So like, it's a lot. And I mean, he's fast, super, super smart dude. Um, it, you know, you can kind of tell the property's going to work in a 15, 20 minute period, but like, uh, it's just a lot of time, energy and money really spent. Cause we go to the, you know, we go to the, um, markets that we're buying these things as well, go tour these things. And sometimes they don't work out. You know, we've had a handful mm -hmm. under contract, and they fall through once you kind of go in person. You're like, ah, yeah, this is not what we thought. Or, you know, truthfully, sometimes sellers just don't, they don't disclose the truth. And yeah. so, you know, our number one priorities are investors, um, you know, maybe behind the tenants, but we'll say one and two is investors and tenants. And if it's not something that we think we will be proud to own, and if we think it's not something that we can make money on for the investors, then we got to walk. And so it's a pretty wild ride for sure. And I, I appreciate you talking about it. Cause yeah, it's a lot of work to lead up to it. And I think that's, that's like what pushes people away is mm -hmm. there's a, a solid year of prepping and understanding and education and stuff before you, in my opinion, before you really want to like jump into the syndication world, because you know, you kind of alluded to this, you're dealing with other people's money, you know, yeah. you're dealing with investor money and you got to take care of it. I always say like, I'm way more scared of their money than mine. Like I'll lose my money and be bummed. Mm -hmm. If I lose someone else's money, I'd be crushed. You know? Sure. Absolutely. Yeah. And I, I can kind of speak to that though. Like, you know, having personally called you looking at one of the, the portfolios, maybe two or three ago, I, I, I sorry, I haven't, you know, I, I, I can't know exactly keep up with them, but <laughs> yeah, <laughs> there's a bunch of, them. but we, you know, we were looking at it and, you know, I was like, I text you and, and I'm like, Hey, you know, my wife and I would, we like to just kind of talk to you about this and you're like, yep, it's like Sunday at 10. And you're like, Hey, let's hop on 20 minute call. And, and I mean, the first thing we said, like, look, you know, if it doesn't feel right, then don't worry about it. Like no sweat off my back. You're still going to be my friend. Like, I, you know, if you don't feel comfortable with this, then, then don't do it. You know? So it's not a, it's not a pressures game, which I, man, I, I really appreciated that. 